So I just want to preach on a couple of gems this morning. It's May 8th. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to the Accepted Students Fiesta at Trinity Western University. Well, can you find love in a fiesta? Of course, it's right on the end. Boom. <laughs> the whole thing equals 60 perfectly in six letters by divine ordinance, and then love equals 54 is right on the end. Um, and this is happening at Trinity Western University, which in three words divides by three. Uh, can you find love at Trinity Western University? Of course you can. And uh, university is love plus love plus love. And then I did it on a computer over here, Trinity Western. You can find or ITY is love number one, T and T is love number two, RI is another half of love, and then pure threes for the rest. Um, and then so some other words I got this morning is push back, as in you are confronted with people that don't have the knowledge of God, that say things and they have no idea what they're doing and they have no idea why they're here and they have no idea what they're saying and they have no idea where they're going because they don't have the Spirit of God. Well, what's the word of the Holy Ghost to you? Push back. <laughs> that is to say, you need to impart truth <laughs> to the truthless. Okay, Push back. So that's a personal word from the Holy Ghost to myself this morning. Um, push back. Okay. Push back. It adds to love plus half of love, and you can find the love plus half of love. It's 81, 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. So here's the uh, half of love there. And then, uh, look, it's pure 27s. Wow. So with the P and the K, the bookends make 27. There's a 27 right there, and then 21 plus 6 is another 27. So by divine ordinance, push back equals 27 plus 27 plus 27. And we found the 327s. That's love plus half a love. What was that word? What was the context of that word from the Holy Ghost this morning? Push back against words and knowledge that are not of God. There's people throwing words all over this universe that have no clue where they're going, no clue who God is, no clue that the language they speak glorifies the Trinity day and night. And so I and we as Christians are called to push back against truthless garbage. <laughs> that is to say, you are to be the speaker. You are to be the one imparting truth to them. They don't know what they're doing. You know what you're doing. You have revelations from God. You tell them what to do. They don't know what to do. Okay, Push back. That's a personal word from the Holy Ghost to me, and I believe to all uh, truth seekers, Christians, people who know the truth. <laughs> uh, we're called you push back, okay? Um, and then push on. That's another obvious phrase that I got as a follow-up that divides by three. Um, push on. And that also gets bookending, just like push back. Um, 30 points in the bookending. O divides by three. Very beautiful push on. You got pairwise threes from the inside out. 27 at the center, flanked in 36, flanked in 30. Just a beautiful six letter, three plus three uh, phrase. So, um, and then another personal uh, ordinance that happened in my life um, two mornings ago, probably, is um, I was short three sons <laughs> at the end of my newspaper route. And so I call Patricia, who is the drop zone manager. And she runs out with her car to give me the three sons that I need. Well, where did I tell her to meet me? at 60th and 192. That's, that's the corner where my newspaper route starts. And it just, while you're in the moment, you're just doing what you do to get what you need to get done. And afterwards, it really sinks in how God ordained this for His glory and confirmation. And God just continues to bombard my life with threes and divine appointments that happen for the number three. So let's get this straight. I'm short three sons. Secondly, three sons. When you speak it, divides by three. We're going to put it on the board in a second. I call Patricia. Derek plus Patricia divides by three. God has been showing me how my first name knits together with other people's first names to divide by three in my whole life. Okay? And um, Derek plus Patricia divides by three, and Derek plus Dennis divides by three. Dennis is the higher level. Uh, administrator, and then Patricia is the drop zone manager of the Vancouver Sun and the province and the Golden Mail National Post in the Langley area. And um, 
But the best part of all, like the most dramatic part of all on top of that, is that the crossroads are 60th Avenue and 192 Street. Those are king numbers for the number three. 60 equals holy, equals pure, equals pray, equals believe, equals word, <laughs> equals diamond. Okay. <laughs> and then 192 is 8 times 24, 8 times triple eight. Good night. <laughs> so, Derek meets Patricia at 60th and 192, 192 to say it correctly, 60th and 192 Street where Patricia gives Derek three sons by divine ordinance to the glory of the Trinity. And so I want to put three sons on the board. Um, and even the words that come out of my mouth when I called her up, I said, I'm sure three sons. And that whole sentence then divides by three. It just, that quick. And then, um, so let's uh, get this on the board here. Um, we got. I, I I really do love this stuff, but I can always uh, re-add it later. So um, let's do the the whole sentence. Three sons. Like th this is an obvious one. I mean. Very rarely. This is in, like I've been I've been delivering this route for months. Started before Christmas around November, and this is the first time that I've ever been short three sons, <laughs> and uh, that's very rare. I mean, usually they count them pretty accurately and all that stuff, but by divine ordinance, folks, it's all perfect. Perfect. So, um, so three sons divides by three. That's 75 plus love, sign equals love, is 129. And then what came out of my mouth is this over here, which is 60 plus 33, 93, 102. So altogether, the whole thing was pure threes, which is uh, 231. 231, 123, beautiful. Okay. And then uh, Derek and Patricia. I'm telling you, it was, a, it was a divine appointment between Derek and Patricia. Okay, so look at this, we got double chain link in the center, 27, plus 6, that's 33, plus 1851, plus 960, uh, plus 27 is um, 87, 90, 99, plus 21, wow, 120 perfectly, that's exceptional. <laughs> Derek plus Patricia equals 120 perfectly, that is exceptional, 120 is king. And, um, and then, oh yeah, and all of this transaction said, she said, well, and I said, meet me at 60th and 192. Like the two kings, four, three, 60 and 192. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. So that there's another divine appointment that happened in my personal life just a couple days ago. And that's something that was totally outside of my control. Like, I didn't work to do that. I didn't plan to do that. It was ordained by heaven. I wake up in the morning, I go to the drop site where they organize all the newspapers for the carriers to pick up. You simply pick up your batch that you have to deliver, you know, expecting it to be counted correctly so that you always have enough, just like every other morning, but lo and behold, I'm short three sons. And this, that, and, and, um, you know, it was by divine ordinance by divine ordinance for the glory of eternity. I have to confess that in the moment while I was waiting for it to arrive, I was starting to feel a little bit frustrated. That's my impatience. That's, that's, my <laughs> that's a little bit of a weakness coming out there. I was impatient. I was, I was like, oh man, now I'm, now I'm wasting time because I'm short three sons. But <laughs> God is calling it to my remembrance and saying to me that happened by divine ordinance for the greater glory of God. <laughs> and for this ongoing signs of threes that are just keep happening to me on a daily basis um, for all this glory of the Trinity. Very cool. Three sons, and then now, see otherwise I wouldn't have done the math between Derek and Patricia. Um, and she's hilarious. I mean, Derek plus Patricia equals 120 perfectly. And then Derek plus Dennis, um, 
Amazingly, that also chain links in the center. Um, Derek plus Dennis, who is the uh, Dennis is the um, the overseer of the whole operation. And uh, my name is forty three. Let's just jump right in there. Forty three plus nine. Uh, 43 plus 23 is 66 plus 9, 75 plus another 33. Oh my goodness, Derek plus Dennis equals 108. That equals worship. That equals love plus love. These are like two kings for the number three. So there you go. And even the name of the company divides by three. Doorstrip Distribution Services, and I'm just like, and of course, Newspaper Carrier divides by three and Carrier and and now, now I have the Chrysler Neon that I'm delivering. Chrysler, love to the left, love to the right. Chrysler equals 108, equals worship. And, um, and then Neon divides by 3, LX divides by 3. It's a 2002. And the coolest part about this car, I might take a video out and um, get some actual footage of it uh, again later, is that uh, by Divine Orance, this is not a personalized plate. By Divine Orance, I got a license plate that says 888 SLV as in 888 silver, and my car is pure silver. Everyone calls it, my, my brothers call it the silver bullet. That's what I've been calling it too, because it's pure silver. I did custom interior trim lining with silver chrome, uh, beautiful lining. The whole interior I lined with chrome and I put three silver eights to the glory of Jesus. It was on the front, on the back, and on the interior, it looks gorgeous. It's all lined in silver, and it's got beautiful LED colored lighting on the inside that illuminates the silver at night, just like tinsel on a, on a Christmas tree. Um, but uh, I can show you, I can take a video of the license plate yourself so you'll see the glory of God. The license plate is 888SLV. Three eights followed by three letters that spell silver, technically, SLV. Um, the story goes, when I went to the ICBC driver's licensing office, this was over a year ago now, um, and uh, I asked her, uh, because Jesus equals 888 was, was my favorite beginning point in all this, I asked her if she had a license plate with a lot of eights in it, okay? And so she went to the back where they have all the, the government printed plates that they give out at the office. And she comes back with a big smile, she comes back with a big smile slash like look of amazement on her face. And she asked me, what color is your car by chance? And I said, silver. And she said, you're gonna love me for this. And she shows me the license plate in her hand, and it says 888 SLV. You cannot deny the perfection of that. <laughs> and it's sitting on the back and the front of my car to this day. At this moment, it's parked right outside this coach house. And it's beautiful silver, Chrysler Neon LX, everything written on the back divides by three. Chrysler equals love to the left, love to the right, slice it in half, love, love. 54, 54, 108 equals worship, and then Neon divides by three, LX. It's the upgraded Neon LX, like the Sport Edition, and best of all, it has a sunroof. Sun equals love, roof equals love. Chrysler, love, love. Sunroof, love, love. Um, as a deeper uh, portion of this story, I received an original brand new Chrysler Neon 2002 as a result of my giving large amounts of anonymous money to the poor. That is a story that is a total God story. Um, and God has taken care of this Chrysler, this this is now a new silver Chrysler 2002 Neon that had no mileage, like basically no mileage. It's in unbelievable condition. Thing is top of brand new. People are like that's a 2002. It's like got so few kilometers and it's in such amazing shape. Um, it's by Divine Orange because when God gave me that two, that original 2002 Chrysler Neon, it was ordained by heaven as a direct result of my giving large amounts of money anonymously to the poor in church offerings, I would just drop cash with no address, no name, no nothing. And it was a word from God that God gave to someone to buy me that car. And it's been, it's now been 13 years since 2002. And I own an even better 2002 Chrysler Neon because God ordained a situation in my life where the car got, uh, I was in a minor accident. We think, oh, what a disaster. God, I thought this was, this car was from you. And the whole thing was ordained because not only did I get, obviously, the insurance covered the value of the accident, but it provided, you know, then God provided me with a brand new 2002 Neon that was even better. Now, it was a sport edition. Secondly, it had a sunroof, better sound system, better everything, unused, mint condition, sport edition, better steering wheel, better handling, and uh, 
unbelievably unused. Like it was like the thing, it was owned by a gentleman, uh, an old man that uh, for some reason barely used it and just had it parked like almost the whole time in, in brand new condition with like, it, I believe it only, it had 64,000 kilometers. That was the advertised mileage. And this was back in only a few years ago. I don't know how many now, maybe four, four years ago, maybe something like that. Maybe slightly less, probably less. Yeah, like maybe three. Um, and I remember that number specifically because that is eight times 8,000 perfectly. And Jesus equals eight of eight, and I can go on eights for a while. But, um, uh, and so right now, as I speak, the car is sitting out there in beautiful silver and, uh, the license plate is 888 SLV and God has not failed to provide the best of everything for that car in 13 years <laughs> since I received it brand new for the first time. So I, I tell you to give copious amounts of anonymous cash to your local church and be amazed at what God gives you in return. Designate it to the poor. That's commonly what I would do. I would put the cash inside an envelope with no writing on it, except on the cover saying, please give this to the poor, the homeless, the needy. <laughs> and um, it's been 13 years now that I've had that. It's like, you don't need, it. You don't need no man fleshly insurance policy. If you give to the poor, God will, will pay for everything. <laughs> And so this, this 2002 Neon story has been going for 13 years now, um, the best of the best. It's in unbelievable condition. I would say there's probably no 2002 Neon on the road in Canada that is, is in good condition and as nice as the one that's parked right outside this house. <laughs> and certainly not one that has a license plate that says 888 SLV, which is not a personalized ordered plate. That was from the government. <laughs> a divine appointment like I just shared <laughs> and um, and uh, I had three silver eights which I had purchased to decorate to put on the back of the car on the trunk you know fender and on the front of the car right on the hood three beautiful silver eights looks beautiful to the glory of Jesus equals eight today and I had that in it was all silver before I went into the driver's licensing office, asked her if she had a license, happened to have a license plate with a lot of eights in it, and lo and behold, she brings out 888 SLV. And she says, what color is your car by any chance? And I said, silver. And she says, you're going to love me for this. And she shows me the plate and it says 888 SLV, 888 silver. And it's out there to this day. So I'll probably take the video camera out there and just show you what it is, show you what it looks like, and <laughs> can see the glory of God. And, be inspired to give to the poor anonymously because <laughs> that's the miracle that's the unlocking of miracles that God will work in your life um, obedience to his word okay so um, that's amazing though so Derek plus Dennis equals 108 Derek plus Patricia equals 120 amazing together those that those two numbers add to my full birth name 228 very nice Okay, um, so were those all the ones I wanted to preach on? Yeah, Fiesta, that's cool. Push back, push on. And then the story with the three sons, um, meeting with Patricia at 60th and 192. Um, too awesome. Okay, perfect.